hi everyone welcome to a new video this video is all about how to log in on ideogram ai so if you're new and you don't know what is ideogram so ideogram is an ai platform where you can create amazing ai images from text or some of the creators have already created some artwork you can use it can do some of your own customization and can get results from it which is ai generated images and then you can use it on all over your social media and other platforms like wherever you want to use it so to log in to this platform it is very easy and very simple you just have to follow a few steps and you will be get logged in on ideogram.ai so let's start this video first you have to open a browser of your choice and on the search bar you have to specifically search for ideogram.ai or you can just type ideogram and then from the results you will find this first link you have to click onto it which is ideogram.ai once you click onto this link you will land onto the website of ideogram first you will see there is a logo of ideogram and we have different options it says login and two options like discord and twitter and here if you don't have an account you can create it by signing up with google but in case you have already created your account and now are just looking to login so therefore you have this option which says login which is on the top side of the screen once you tap or click onto this option you will successfully get back to your account make sure you already have created your account otherwise it will not do that for you after that you will get login here here you can see we have the icon of ideogram on the left side of the screen and few two options at the right side of the screen and also we have a search bar and some categories and below it we have a lot of different images so let's say you want to create an ai generated image before you select categories like if you want a poster if you want a 3d and after that you will type what you're actually looking for so here i'm looking for anime therefore i just typed anime now it is creating some images related to that prompt it actually takes a while to create ai images that you have given prompt of so here it has created four images you can choose any one of these whatever you like and if you want something customization you can also do that you have to simply click onto this option and then you have to give a prompt like what you're specifically looking into this image so here i type a girl with blue hair or maybe with pink hair and with blue eyes or black eyes whatever comes to your mind you can type it and it will again take time to process your prompt and once it done doing it it will show you some of the images so here four different variations you can select whatever you like the most and you can use that one so likewise whatever you type it will create for you so here we have some of the designs if you like any one of these you can also create yours you just have to do some changes in it by just simply click onto this option and here you can see it is a typography so i will try to change the names that are written onto this side so for that you have to look onto the prompt and see where the change is required you have to just change that thing what you're looking for here i'm just going to change the names in this picture once it's done i'll just simply click on generate again it will just take a while and after that it will create four different variations of images and from these four images i can choose whatever i like the most so here it has created four different images and it has the changings that i did in the prompt so like whatever you like you can use it you can just pin it and download it and can post it on your different social media platforms so if we click onto the icon of this ideogram we will get back to the home page where we will see different kind of artworks that people have created and we could also use it so here i will try to create a poster for a movie or maybe anything else but first i will select poster and then it will create four of the images for me and from these four images i will do some changings and then it will create images according to the prompts that i have given to it so here i just search for barbie it has just created four different images for me if you want to like the image you just have to simply click onto this red icon and you could also pin it 
and if you just simply click onto this remix option you can do some editing or you could say changings in this prompt so if you just want to log out from this platform ideogram ai you could easily do that first you have to click onto the icon and then you will land onto the home page after that you just have to simply click onto this me option this one once you click onto it you will get into your profile there you will see this settings icon along with your username just simply click on it and just simply click on log out and then you will get back here if you again want to log in just simply click on login and if you already have logged in with your gmail account it will don't ask you for your username and password and it will get logged into your account so that's it this is how you can log in onto ideogram.ai hope you found this video interesting and helpful and make sure to subscribe to the youtube channel for more informative videos and updates and thank you for watching the video